We are supporting the rebuilding effort by getting people back home. That was what we talked about doing early on, is getting them there, and that's what we're doing now. And how we facilitated that process is to change all the policies we have our power to change, to streamline efforts, to give them tools to make decisions, to know when we need to encourage them to move forward and know when we need to get out of the way and let them move forward. We're, we're there, we're part of this community and we're gonna help you and others get back into their homes. The city is taking a very progressive stance when it comes to delivering new technologies to assist people with the rebuild. Uh, what we found early on in the process is the audiences are very diverse. Input from residents, developers, and contractors involved in the rebuilding of our community has helped to guide much of its content. srcity.org rebuild is where you can find all tools, data, and resources created to guide and track rebuilding efforts in the city of Santa Rosa. The Resilient City Recovery Maps, a rebuild data tracker, and a parcel report search. Within the Resilient City Recovery Maps portal is a menu of maps each providing different pieces of information important to the rebuild. For instance, within the Recovery Progress Map, use the legend in the upper right corner of that page to determine if a property is in the cleanup, permitting, or construction phase of rebuilding. For each map, users can view the status of a specific property simply by clicking on that property. Additional maps within this portal will provide detail on building setbacks and zoning for each property, land surveyor activity, encroachment permit activity, building permit activity, and right-of-way activity. Users can access more detailed information about a given property through the Resilient City Parcel Report search tool. Each parcel report provides planning and design considerations property setback measurements, as well as documents the city has on file related to the parcel. And drone aerial imagery of each individual lot. With this tool, users can also track the status of a permit and where it is in the review process, or find information about a property's city utilities. Compiling this data all in one place Easily accessible to our rebuild community is imperative and is one of the ways we are working to expedite various steps of this journey. So the steps we've taken to use technology with the permitting process and taking advantage of the potential for electronic plan review. People can walk in with a thumb drive. That was one of the first things that we landed on that became a real benefit that was immediately noticed and, and it sped up the process. We're actually taking plans in electronically, sending them all over the state to have people all over the state help us out to get those plans reviewed back to us, back in your hands so you can get your house rebuilt as quick as possible. For me, what makes Santa Rosa home is a lot of different things, and I, I imagine that's the case for many of the residents here. Uh, there, there's some obvious, it's the weather, it's proximity to the coast, it's the beautiful hillsides that we have, but for me it's the people, and it always has been. Um, I remember early on in the process, we, we started assisting people in the fire rebuild through the local assistance center, and a lot of the people I talked to then, I talk to now, I never forget the faces, every single one. It's always about the people for me, that's my community, I want to see them come back. We are here for you and we want to get back into these homes and we want to get back to our community that we had 